I don't, I don't know him. I'm not a Galilean. No, no. I don't know him. A dream. More like a nightmare. Always the same. It comes unexpected, unaware. Just like that night. Some days I, I feel so unmovable, indestructible. Patriots to solid rock. It's my arrogance. I have to guard against it. Otherwise, I, I stop watching and praying. I'm fighting instead of submitting. Then after a while, I act as if I don't even know him. I know better than Judas. How did I allow these Gentiles to drive me away from my master, to deny him? I remember them, all of them, their faces, their looks, their remarks. And to think how I, I used to try to keep them away, keep all of them away from my Lord, my Lord. They would press in on him, ask of him, always touching him, wanting a piece of him, the Gentiles. He loved them. He loved them all. Maybe I, I thought, I found him first. He's mine. Forgive me, Lord. My Lord. You know, I remember the first time I saw him. Uh, he wasn't much to behold, I tell you. A wisp upon the sea. Slight. We had been out all night fishing. It was an abysmal. Oh, we didn't catch a thing. Oh, I take that back. I caught a chill from the, from the wind whipping across the sea that night. And Andrew, oh Andrew, he forgot to bring the drink. So needless to say, come morning, I was in no mood to tarry. I just wanted to get home. So there we were, washing our nets along the shoreline, and a crowd had gathered. Jesus was speaking to them. Andrew used to, used to speak of this Jesus and of his works, but I knew nothing what he taught. I cared nothing for what he was saying. All I knew is John, James, and Andrew, they hung on every word. So much, they were useless to me cleaning the net. <laughs> so there I am, cleaning my net cursing them with those salty fishermen curses. And I look up, and Jesus steps into my boat. Andrew quickly came up behind me, put his hand on my shoulder. Hear him, brother. <laughs> then he looked at me. It wasn't the way he looked at me. It was the way he looked through me. I was caught. I had nowhere to go. I was a large fish in a fisherman's net. But there was something, something about him, his presence. And then he spoke to me. He told me to take my boat out into the deep water and, and put my nets down for a catch. <laughs> yeah. I called him master, but I, but I was thinking, what a foolish thing he asked. So I say to him, master, we have been out all night fishing, working really hard. We haven't caught anything. Andrew reaches out again, eager to convince me. So I agree. Because you say so, I will take my boat out into the deep water and I will lay down my net. Boy, I barely got those words out of my mouth. Andrew joked in the boat in his net. <laughs> so there we were, deep water, nets down for a catch. And I couldn't believe it. I could see them in the water, thousands of them glistening in the sun. And I called out to Andrew. Soon John and James, they rolled up. And the four of us, we could barely pull all the fish into our boats. In all my years of fishing, I have never seen or heard anything like this. <laughs> and that's when I knew. I knew it. 
I was in the boat with Messiah. And a wave of fear washed over me. And I said, Depart from me, O Lord, for I am a sinful man. I am not worthy. And Jesus knelt down. And he picked up my head. He said, Do not be afraid. Follow me, and I will make you fishers of men. I gave up everything that day to follow him. I would have done anything for him. I would have died for him. So I thought. I recall something in the way he called my name. An ordinary fisherman, he called me friend and took me in. How everything has changed, and now I know I'll never be the same. Love came and rescued me. I gave up my everything to follow. I was before it won't matter anymore for I am a new man for I have seen my Savior face to face in the courtyard by the fire his words still ringing in my head three times before the break of morn you will deny and yet I saw no judgment in his eyes love came and died for me I gave up my everything to follow now I know all that I was before is died and lives no more for I am a new man for I have seen my Savior 